I think the problem is, because uh, I'm, I'm 35, I should have a child, biologically now, so I don't. So instead I put all of this love and attention onto the internet. That just checking on us and making sure it's like, are you okay, internet? And it repays me like a child with, with occasional cuteness to be like, look, a piglet in Wellington's. Oh, internet, you're wonderful. <laughs> But then it just, it ends up taking up all of my time, just luring me in, like, oh, I better check my email. Oh, I better check my old email, even though no one ever emails me on it. <laughs> better look at the news. Better look at international news to see if the Irish news is making it all up again. <laughs> better look at eBay to see if there's tiny keyboards for sale. <laughs> better look at dogsindistress.com, even though I don't want to foster a fucking puppy. And then somehow it's six hours later, I'm lying on the ground looking at... Jamiroquai videos from 1993. Oh, space cowboy, when are you going to return? This is virtual insanity. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, members of Team O'Doherty. He was recently described by the Irish Times as a national treasure, that is true. Five days later, described by the same newspaper as not everyone's cup of tea. <laughs> Prepare to make up your own mind. It'll get ready for the comedy equivalent of an IMAX film. It'll be like an IMAX, but with less recently divorced fathers with their six-year-old children. Son, finish this waste paper basket of Coca-Cola. Your mother gets you back in an hour and I don't want you to sleep for a week. <laughs> is Shannon Doherty from Beverly Hills 90210. His father is Pete Doherty, the drug addict. <laughs> Holy shit, it's David O'Doherty. <laughs> Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Florence and this is my machine. That reference could date slightly, so... My name is Huey Lewis. This is my news. Thank you very much for coming, everyone. I realize I'm not very famous, which means that all of you must be pretty cool, yeah. If I ever get big, you have to like, yeah, you used to like him ages before you douche but do douche gags, what else? Douche gags are a special sort of comedy that <laughs> only idiots like. Welcome people here. Welcome people listening in the future. That sounds pretty incredible when you put it like that. Uh, we are, uh, I hope you like it. I hope every, I mean, that's all I can say. I hope you like it. You know, I, I, it's not what, it's, I don't think everyone, I'm offering no guarantees with some of them. All I'm saying is I'm pretty sure I would like this a lot. I'm pretty sure if I was sitting in this audience already, I'd be going, this is one of the best things I have ever seen. <laughs> I've thought of all these things, and he's wearing my clothes too, W.T. Falk. It would be a confusing thing if I was there. Party, 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 party. People stand in the kitchen, they're talking about the King's Speech. Pretty good film is the general consensus. There's gonna be lots of ladies and men. There's some cheese in the kitchen. Baby bells, there'll be streamers flying through the air. Someone will probably go home wearing someone else's coat. It's gonna be fucking mayhem! Party, party, party. It's that sort of party, thank you. 